in the heavyweight division. These are big, strong, athletic fighters. Limiting the opportunities for a great light heavyweight champion to do what many great light heavyweight champions have done in the past, move up to the heavyweight division. It was one thing when Bob Foster and Archie Moore were moving up to fight 210-pound fighters. It's quite another thing, Roy, for somebody like you at 175 to consider trying to fight a 245-pounder. Yeah, you're right. Especially at 5 foot 11 inches. Doesn't make enough sense. Hockey box numbers through the fifth round. Total of 145 punches have been landed, and only a handful of them were jabs. This is a power shot exhibition. Jefferson throwing far more punches than Harris. In fact, more than 100 more through the first five rounds. So in terms of activity, the fight has belonged to Jefferson. Harris has been slightly the more accurate puncher. pace of the fight slows as both fighters have gone to the body enough in the early going to wear the opponent down somewhat. Hard right hand to the body there by Jefferson. And Jefferson is slowly but surely trying to wear Maurice's hands down now. Maurice's arms seem heavy and he seems like he doesn't want to work much because I think his arms are a little tired. Yeah, he's trying to slow the fight down. And shot landing for Jefferson there. Harris has taken a lot of leather in this fight. <laughs> Saw Maurice up on the jab a moment ago. It could have been a big weapon for him if he got it going. Oh. Watch behind it. But Jefferson ended that with his power punches early. And now Harris go out again. It was a left hook. Inside Five, on the ropes. He won't three, expect this time. Seven, eight, five. All right, baby. You made it. You made the count, baby. You made the count. You made the count. Harris comes in with his hands down. Jefferson makes him pay with a leaping left. 30 seconds left, and you wonder if Mo Gotta can get out of the round. Here he comes back. Harris showing gumption with that left hook to the body. And he lands a left oh, hook. Uh, 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 and now Jefferson wobbles again. Can Jefferson come down? Can he stay on his feet? Oh, that's oh, it. Oh, oh, what a left that's hook it. shot. That oh, is no. It. No count necessary. No, Derek but Jefferson, I love you. <laughs> What a shot. Same thing. That left hook, Derek Jefferson kept tapping Maurice's left hook because Maurice's left hand stays straight up in the air when he throws the left hook. And Jefferson tapped that from round one. And once the fight got late and it got slow in the fight, you knew he would catch Maurice again with that left hook. This was one of the sizzling knockout punches of recent years in the heavyweight division. Derek Jefferson ripping the night apart with a left hook to separate Maurice Harris momentarily from his senses, and we hope only momentarily. Mo talking now to those around him. At least two doctors on the scene. And Jefferson trying to catch his breath. 